Okay, so when's the last time that you did something nice for someone, and what did you do? I helped an old dude up off of his driveway because they fell like two days ago. That's nice. That is nice. That is really nice. Anyone else? Okay, so when is the last time that someone did something nice for you? My baby did quote for Michael Jackson. <laughs> That's good, EJ. My girlfriend uh, went to Hutch and bought me some things for our anniversary. That's like the last thing that I can remember. That's really sweet. Okay. Someone give me the answers to an assignment. Good for you. Those are real assignments. Okay. So close your eyes and imagine this. You live in a world where there are no smiles or smirks. You don't make any eye contact with anyone. You have no smiles, no smirks, no head nods, nothing. The thought behind this is pernicious to society. The negative effects that stem from this are why I support being nice to others. Using that, I will try to persuade you and others to do the same. After researching the effects that being kind to others has on other people, I am convinced that I am designated to share this information with you. It has become a lot more easier for people to treat others poorly with the huge growth in social media in the recent years. Which, I had a picture of the growth in social media, but it was really blurry, so I just kind of put this in there. Um, okay. Negativity towards people is at an all-time high. Most of you have probably had someone that wasn't nice or kind towards you. This especially applies to teenagers as well as people of all ages. A study conducted by Dartmouth found that positivity affects your life in many ways. While the act of kindness affects others around you, it can affect oneself as well. Being kind can significantly affect all aspects of one's life. Being kind affects your happiness, your lifespan, your love hormone, hormone and your energy. To be nice, it's essential to be nice to others for many reasons, especially since you have to interact with others every day. I came across info on the Why You Should Be Kind to People website about the effects being kind to others can do. Surprisingly, after the list was made, it made for a happier environment. Even smiling can have a broad effect on the brain. Being nice is in many cultures. It's very significant in the American culture, and many studies have been carried out over why you should be nice. Okay, according to Here's why you should be kind to everyone always. The act of kindness is defined as a gesture of goodwill towards someone or something. The lessons I learned from this are crucial. A few lessons you can take from this is being nice often comes back to you. It usually awards you in the end. Being nice makes sense to society. Do something kind for someone and even for yourself. And at all costs, don't be rude. Let's look at the effects that smiling has on the brain. According to There's Magic in Your Smile, the, the act of smiling activates neural messaging that benefits your health and happiness. Smiling activates the release of neuropeptides that work toward fighting off stress. Um, and according to an article titled The Effects of Smiling by Dr. Patrick Broom, <coughs> smiling stimulates the award mechanism in our brain, the same way chocolate does. Ron Gutman states, smiling has many benefits that help you appear more attractive, look more competent, feel better, and even live a longer life. Smiling more leads to a similar to similar stimulants in the brain the same way that a tasteful sugary treat does. Applying smiling and laughter into your day can completely alter it. Not only for you, but those around you. Not only does smiling affect your brain, it affects your body. There are specific endorphins in your brain that are linked with natural pain relievers as well as happiness. When all the chemicals in your brain react, it can be de detrimental not only to your health but to your life as a whole. If you're ever feeling negative, keep positivity in the back of your mind. According to a 2011 study by Psychology Today, both men and women were more attracted to people who made eye contact and smiled in images. Not only does it make you feel better, but it makes you more approachable to others. With this, with all this being said, being nice to others is critical in many ways. I have provided you with information about the effects smiling has on the brain, even when others are not always kind to you. Always do your best to be kind to them. 
If we are all kind to one another, we can change the world. One of the only ways for the world to change is to apply this into our daily lives. Always remember, this is not just for you, but for everyone.